Hello YouTube, this is Christonian here and we are playing another indie showcase. Today is Earthfall. It's a very brand new game. Uh, it's going for about five euros right now. I'll have the link down below. And uh, it's only been out for like a month, I believe, and this is basically very, very early alpha. So Earthfall is an isometric survival exploration sandbox game. It features a list of constantly expanding uh, developments as they go forward. Uh, right now you can hunt uh, or be hunted, uh, crafting or scavenging, uh, building, uh, there's multiplayer, person versus person, procedural generated worlds, and weather and temperature system. So we're just going to jump right in. And uh, as always, if you guys really like it, uh, just tell me and uh, we can see the future together. So that was just me uh, harvesting a uh, tree, basically. It's as easy as that. We can uh, zoom right in with our mouse wheel. We can, uh, I, that's as close as I guess we can go. But uh, we can uh, WASD to uh, drive us around. So you can like strafe and stuff, but, and then you can use your mouse just to aim your guy and only use W if you wanted to. Uh, we can zoom out again. Oh crap. <laughs> we might be dead. Oh, 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 there's another one over there. Uh, <laughs> uh, C to bring up your uh, character list. And this is just the kind of way I like to have it set up. So let's go like that. And then we have our inventory. Oh, can't move the inventory. And R. R to bring up our crafting um, menu, I guess you can call it. Uh, let's zoom out. Yeah, see, so you can zoom way out, but I don't want to zoom that far out. So I'll just bring it in like this, and then we'll just suck it up with the crafting menu, taking up a little bit of our space. So again, you just click on what you want to do. So we got some 24 berries, we got uh, 6 tree logs right now, 11 fibers, and 10 sticks. So let's get some rocks, and then we can uh, craft some weapons. And get right into the, we're not going to get our butt whooped area. Okay, so we should be able to do a shovel, a saw, an axe. I'm probably just going to use the axe for now. I could do a bow, but I don't know if I want to mess with that right now. See, this looks like it's harvestable, but I don't know how to do it yet. I have shovel, saw. See, I don't see anything for, like, scythe or anything. Come here, little sheepy. Die much. There we go. So we go harvest here. And, ah, there we go. So can I, no, I can't. So this is going to have to go up here. Hmm. We'll put it like this. And then we can still see our health, our water, or maybe temperature. I think it's water. And then our sleeping. So we're getting tired as we do more and more. So we got some uh, sheep meat and sheep fur. And for like an alpha, it's like quite expansive. Ooh, when wolves attack. See, and this is where I said you could just like scavenge because you could just watch the mayhem. <laughs> or you could save the sheep and become the savior for sheeps. Die. <laughs> Everybody. Okay. Um, dang it, because the... Two bodies are over each other. Oh, yeah. Okay. So I like how the world loads in and everything. Uh, this is actually a really good area. Because it's actually perfectly flat. Which uh, is probably the first time I've seen that. <laughs> so. Here is our crafting system. You can go under wooden to see a whole bunch of wooden options. Weapons. Uh, survival. Uh, clothing. And then stone and power. Right now it just shows wooden fence under power. So 
So let's go back to let's see survival. I haven't I haven't made like a campfire or anything. Uh, I got a saw, I think. So we're good to go there. So let's put down the campfire. Bam! It's almost like we're expanding society. A uh, fishing rod. Hmm. Let's craft one of those. Sleeping bed. Oop. What do we need? Deer hide. Okay. And a torch. Hmm. We we can inspect it. Oh, okay. So that's probably. I have to like go like this, go like that. Uh, yep. So that's gonna be a pain in the butt. I wish I could move this around. Implement it, developer, and he shall. And if you guys really like it, we can actually follow the development of this game because uh, it is quite thin. And okay, so we did that. Now let's say light. Bam! Lighting effects. Cool. These rocks are humongous. And uh, even though they're different colored rocks, it's not like I got like ore out of one of them, you know. They're always stone. Right now. Okay. So we need uh, deer. There we go. Here's some deer. Holy crap. Two wolves over there. Hey, hi, hi, hi. Ah, just your meat. Okay, deer hide, so we can, and let's move forward here. And then also on my body, when I take damage, it'll come up on there. Hmm, poop. Ay, 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 ay. <laughs> okay, so we got a bunch of deer meat. Oh, that's what we could do. We could put meat into uh, that fire, maybe. Maybe that's how you cook uh, meat. Ah. Hmm. Nothing. Weird. Right. Nothing. Let's get back there and check this again. Yeah. Nothing. Weird. I guess it happens. And I. I, I nah. You can live another day. So let's uh, harvest some uh, fruit or uh, berries. We'd like some berries, please. And yes, there is no sound. I don't know if that's my version of the game or... Because in the menu, it does have sound. And then once I got into game, it didn't have sound. So I'm not really complaining because I'm enjoying the game. Okay, so I was going to do clothing first, but let's do a sleeping bed. Hi-ho! Ah, got to press craft item. And then we can place it near the fire. Bam! I like how it, like... Ah, cool. It, like, instantly goes. Uh, inspect. Because I want to see if we can mess around with this. Hmm. I could put it, like, up here, like this, and then drag it down when I need it. I like it! So it had six in there, now it has four. Now you guys could probably yell at me and say, uh... Store. What about there we go? Store. There we go. Store. Now we'll see if uh it actually cooks in there. We'll come back a little bit later. Uh let's go clothing. Got ourselves a deer hat. Oh, it comes with antlers and everything. Flip flops. Oh, we can build those. And gray boots. Oh, we can build those, so we don't need our flip-flops anymore. Uh, a top hat. Badass. And a winter jacket. Hmm. I'm going for a top hat. <laughs> uh... Ah, there they are. Pretty boots. Top hat. Hi ho! <laughs> so 
Let's see if there's any more... Ah, what happened to our crafting? There we go. Yeah, it's actually not that bad of a deal. I might just get rid of it all the time. Okay. I just want to see if, like, new stuff comes up as we gather more stuff, I guess. I can take down this. I'll make our walking easier. The wolves are attacking. See, I'm wondering if I use the shovel, can I, like, pick up flowers? Whoa, cool. I just don't want to get stuck down there. Hmm. So I could, like, tear it down. So I could do that. And can I... Ah! Okay, so there we go. And go like this. Go like that. Okay. So we got, like, a staircase going on here. Ah! No! <laughs> I don't want to be stuck down here. <laughs> I don't feel brave enough to, uh... To, uh, go mining. <laughs> Especially in Alpha. <laughs> Might get myself stuck. Okay, so we can keep on building over here, because this is all flat, which is going to be nice. And let's see over here. I want to see if I can actually get, like, the wheat. Nope. Hmm. Oh. Cool. Okay. <laughs> so if I right-click, I can dig up. <laughs> Trial and error. Crystodian tries and dies. Just like normal. Okay. So let's go R... Let's do survival again. I want to do a bandage. And we did a fishing rod, I believe. And we have a torch. Uh, clothing, I don't believe we collected anything newer. But what we can do in here... Ooh, wheat farm. Planks and a shovel. Hell yeah. And then, uh, shorts. Are they literally shorts? Why would they be wooden shorts? We're going to put them on anyways. Uh, the floor chest, and let's craft some uh, planks. Get 12 of those. Actually, we have one more log, so we'll go for 15. And then we'll make some wooden floors. Like four. And door frame. Hmm. Yeah, let's do it. One and a wooden fireplace. One and rain catcher. Cool. And walls. Derp. So I only have two walls. <laughs> All right. So we'll back ourselves up here and. I use... There we go. Bam! Got ourselves a semi-house going on. Okay. Um, did we make a chest? I don't think we did. We made a door frame. So we can put it like... Oh. There we go. Cool! I like it! And then... Uh... Use. Right? Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> That's what's been happening. Because <laughs> I've been using the friggin' uh, axe. There we go. Or not the axe, the shovel. So. Hmm. Ah, okay. Maybe I have to go on the outside. Nope. There we go. There we go. So now there's a physical wall that I can't go around. Okay. Listen to me. You can do it. 
Wonder if I can rotate. I can! Oh! Ho, ho. Push down the mouse wheel for that. And it looks so pretty. Come on. There we go. Bam! It's coming together. Oh, let's go. What? <laughs> Why did I put it way outside? No! Can I... Nope. What the heck? Why... Hmm. Weird. Alright, let's put these shorts on. Oh, I got my sexy shorts on. Don't you see me? You can actually see them down here, actually, a lot better. Let's bring them near the fire. Look at those red shorts. Okay. Concentrate. <laughs> Having too much fun. Let's uh, cut down some of this stuff. And we're just providing for our walls. We're going to have more than enough, I think, after this. Okay. And then we'll get our walls up, and then we'll try doing <laughs> the fireplace again. Uh, R. Uh, oh, gotta do planks first. Thirty-three planks. That's how I like to do it. Um, uh, got four on the one wall. Five. We need five in total. Okay. There we go. And let's see what a bandage does. Uh, use. Okay, so my main body is good to go. Now it's focusing on my leg. My leg is good to go. And my arm is still hurting. Man, that took a lot. <laughs> that wolf was whooping my butt. So that should work like oh. Hmm. Looks like it's slightly lined up. <laughs> okay, so I estimated that right. What did you do? I wonder if that rock is messing everything up. Where'd that wall go? Yeah, the wall did another wall over here like it did when I tried to do that. Poop. Okay. Uh, R. And wood wall. And there we go. Okay, let's get back in there. And do wood wall. Listen to me. Okay, zooming. Zooming in. Back it up. Back it up. Oh, no. <laughs> well, that actually works. There's like a room divider now. <laughs> Makes it into like two separate. Oh, that actually looks pretty cool. Because you could have like your bed back there. I guess so. I can light that mess up. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got wooden crate, too. Hmm. Let's craft one of those. <laughs> They're like, concentrate, custodian. Oh, window frame. Let's try one of those. Craft that. And a window frame. Ha ha! Outsmarted you. Ta da! It looks so pretty. Okay. Right. And we have a crate. I was thinking like outside. And then let's see if we can do a bed. Yeah. Yeah. And I don't think there's a way to pick up the bed. No. He just jumps right in it. Okay. So we're at 100. We have uh, water probably going to become an issue. 
And let's go under R again. I just want to see if we could go survival, not survival, uh, wooden wheat farm. One, two, three, four. You don't have enough to craft, so I only made two. Okay. Uh, use. What? Dang it. <laughs> I had another floor, I think. Uh, wheat farm. Or maybe that's the way they look. Yeah, that might be. Yeah, that's the way they look. So it's probably just alpha stuff. Oh, there we go. Replant. Replant. Hmm. Okay, so we're at the 21 minute mark here, guys. Thanks for coming by. Hope you guys are enjoying. So we do have a storage container now. And as you walk away, you lose your storage, which is nice, realistic. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe as always. And if you would like to see more or continued coverage as this game updates, make sure you message down below. I actually think it's quite cool. On our next episode, if uh, you guys want to see more, we could put in a new bed, possibly a chest maybe underneath that window, and a fireplace somewhere, because we also didn't do the fireplace right. So uh, thanks for coming by, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed, and as always, see you guys next time. Okay, bye for now.